preaching like I was at this time. God's showing me stuff, you know, like even watching it again today, I'm saying, wow, Lord, your word is so good. It's so clear. It's, it's so merciful. There's so much love here. And, and we'd just like to keep doing this week after week, bringing you the light of Christ, the word of God. And Peter's written a booklet called Hear, Fear God and Give Him Glory. I was going to say hear God and give him glory. Hear God too, but <laughs> fear God and give him glory. And we'd like to give it to you as a gift. Just call the 800 number or go to our website, renewalministries.net. Click on free booklet and we'll get it right out to you. Uh, was, you. You need every day to hear the word of God. You need every day to say yes to him. You need every day to say, Jesus, I trust in you. Until next week, this is Ralph Martin and Peter Herbeck wishing you the very best that the light of Christ may illumine the choices you are facing. One of the most overlooked yet foundational spiritual gifts is the fear of the Lord. The scriptures call this gift a fountain of life, a source of confidence and the beginning of wisdom. Today, our culture, politics, and even the church are in crisis. Everyone can see the deep division, the escalation of anger and violence, and whole nations seem to be in the grip of fear. We have come to fear the wrong things, the opinions of men, and losing our idols. The fear of God is not in the land, and God in his mercy is shaking the nations to wake us up so we hear his word. Do not fear what this people fear. Rather, fear God and give him glory. In this booklet, I explain the fear of the Lord, why it is an antidote to the current crisis, and how you can awaken this gift in your life. To receive a free copy, visit our website or call the number on the screen.